hey guys so the pixel 3 family is now official and apart from the hardware upgrades it also comes with some exciting new features software features so let's take a look at them and how you can get them on your android smartphone first off we have the brand new pixel 3 launcher which is having a new search bar and it has google assistant icon right there you also get similar search bar in the dashboard menu also and the exciting part of this launcher is that it also affects the recents whenever you will open an application info section from the recents it will open in full menu and that means it will cover half of the application previously it was different so that is something nice next up is the new pixel 3 and the 3xl still and live wallpapers there are tons of new sleek wallpapers they respond to your touch sound and motion also and along with these wallpapers you also get some effects on the always on display so you will get a small highlight in the always on display that is something nice and the pixel 3 comes with a brand new ios ish camera interface we have it right here running on the pixel 2 xl and the menu looks really nice we have a tons of options one thing that I really love is the new zoom feature. All you need is just tap on the icon and you can easily zoom. Next up is the playground AR stickers. The new playground stickers including Marvel Iron Man, The Hulk and other Avengers will be available later this month. Here's a sneak peek. Content and characters including the Avengers in celebration of Marvel Studios 10 year anniversary. These characters are rendered to feel lifelike in the scene and they even interact with each other. And once available you will be able to install them from right here. So these are all the Pixel 3 exclusive features for other smartphones. I have no idea which one of them is going to work for you. The launcher is working fine on all the Android smartphones. And for live wallpapers you will need Android Pie. Google camera only works for the Pixel and Pixel 2 family. Maybe it will work for the users who are running Pixel Experience firmware. Let me know in the below comment section if this thing works for you. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and peace out.